Antarctica, the final continent, a place of dreams, wonders, and amazement. Ice formations the size of a skyscraper. This is a place that most people have thought about and dreamed of, but have never actually pictured going to. It's a land of beauty and harsh realities. It's one of extremes in all fashions, including the difficulty of traveling here. For those up to the task, the rewards are incredible. More wildlife on a single day can be seen here than anywhere else in the world. This is an experience you will never forget. The daily life of a Gentoo penguin is a funny one to an outsider such as ourselves. Watching them waddle around the ice, looking for rocks for their nests, or just taking a nice nap makes up most of their time on land. While clumsy on the ground, in the sea they are absolutely graceful. Deep on the Antarctic Peninsula, we have the chance to observe the Gentoo penguin. These little guys make Antarctica their home for the summer months. They not only nest in Antarctica, but they are the only penguins to live here for an extended period of time. Their main predators are seals, especially the leopard seal. They seek higher rocky areas to nest for safety, but when they leave for the ocean, they are always at risk. Then spending their winters at sea for months without touching dry land. They do love to swim though. Jumping through the waters is always a favorite pastime. When you come to Antarctica, you'll definitely have a chance to see them, and frequently a lot of them, as there are over 700,000 of them in the area. Today we are back in Antarctica and surrounded by Gentoo penguins everywhere we look. Finally the moment that everyone comes to Antarctica for to see a penguin colony in person. These are little guys. Uh, we are going to get bigger ones, but in the meantime we've got millions of these surrounding us in every direction as far as you look. Nothing but penguins and also of course that special penguin smell. Uh, there are other birds breeding around them as well, which is really interesting. So as you look, you see the harmony of everything kind of living together here uh, in this harsh environment and trying to survive in whatever they've got. Uh, follow us along. Let's see some more of these little guys as we walk carefully. This is nesting season, so if you look carefully, you might actually see some sitting on eggs. Even right there, if you see that one right in the middle, this little baby directly underneath, staying warm, tucked under its mother or father in this case, because the males take care of the babies as well.
We're hiking now over to see an ancient whale skeleton from the days of the whalers. This dates back over a hundred years, of course, nothing now. But there's a complete whale skeleton up ahead here. Take a look at the nest they're building with the rocks. And I think that's a stick or someone's bone. How adorably cute is that? <laughs> Here you get to see a reconfigured, but real 100 year old whale skull. As we depart the white continent and say goodbye to Antarctica, sailing across the South Atlantic Ocean, over to what might be the most magical wildlife destination on Earth, South Georgia Island. In the middle of nowhere, on the way to Africa, just above Antarctica, here is where you go to truly get your experiences with Antarctic wildlife. You will walk amongst thousands of king penguins, elephant seals, fur seals, including their feisty pups. Traveler's bucket list. This is your place you want to go. It is far, it is distant, it is hard to get here, but look at this payoff. It's unbelievable.
The scenery here is drastically different in the summer months than in Antarctica. Still cold, but green and lush with waterfalls flowing from the mountains, crisp blue seas, and beautiful rocky beaches. We are so happy you were able to enjoy and follow along our journey to Antarctica and the Southern Islands. South Georgia is a destination we will never forget. The wildlife experiences across this trip were unbelievable. Even with all the travels we've had the opportunity to do, this trip, which was years of planning in the making, finally came together in a true wondrous experience. Uh, we made a few new little friends, or probably a couple million of them. One of the largest king penguin colonies in the entire world is behind us. It is literally body to body king penguins. Um, this is truly incredible and beautiful to see. Uh, we also have a lot of elephant seals, including a few adults finally, which is really cool. And this place is just gorgeous. We hope you eventually will have the chance to do this too, and we would love to help plan your trip when it's time. Contact us and we will make something wonderful like this journey happen for you and your family. <laughs>